Okay, and to continue on with example B, for every blank number of students, there are blank iPads. All right, so I see two iPads, and I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten students. So I can write this as ten to two. But what if there's only one iPad? I would divide by two to get one, and ten divided by two is five. This is called a unit rate. This is our key idea. Unit rates have the number one somewhere in the ratio. So this is just a regular ratio. This is a unit rate. This is a regular ratio. This is a unit rate. These are also called equivalent rates because they have the same value. Okay, it's time for your guided practice. And here are your solutions when you're ready to check. Your independent practice on your own, on a separate sheet of paper, standing table when you're done, you have two problems, E and F. Thanks for an awesome screencast.